To treat anxiety, anxiety disorders. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which which means people don't want to enter the elevator or air, airplane phobia phobias. What are you doing? You don't go around the fear. You go inside the fear. And it's the same in one part in OCD treatment that you expose yourself to your fear you wanted to make exposure therapy today right and there's the bench and that is my exposure therapy today because i go around actually sitting somewhere in the city wherever that is i mean it's a simple park bench right but to me it would take a lot to finally sit there. I mean, it also very depends on my state of mind today. But um, usually I tend to go around, especially when I'm alone, why should I sit somewhere, right? But when I'm with somebody, the most common habit is, hey, come on, let's sit on the bench or let's sit on the grass in the park. Yay! It's worst thing ever for me. There's also an, uh, suspense to that exposure. Things which are very hard for you and some things are not so hard. And today we're going to try to sit on a bench and let's see how that feels. Because there's always a feeling after <sighs> let's sit on the bench. What? Ah. Why do I don't sit anywhere? I had a lot of situations in Berlin. I've seen things you wouldn't believe. I experienced something which actually nobody wants to experience. Let's say some people use seats in the city, in the underground for instance, as their toilet. I say it like that leave it standing there and soak and when you are constantly <laughs> experience that <sighs> gosh okay yeah I mean first of all I check where I going to sit I mean I would not sit here if it's completely dirty that exposure is not today because it's like 30 degrees and I don't give up but I'm trying to do that today so I already checked here so this is the spot here on the very edge where I could sit, but I, now I see that there is something and um, how I'm going to do that. So usually I'm, I'm just sitting on the edge, so I don't even sit on the whole seat or bench. And the point is, it's dirty here, so how should I just sit here? Um, maybe I'm come closer to there, but there's dirt as well. You see, that is the rumination going on. Um, and I don't know how to solve that now. Uh, let's see. Mm. Do you know what it feels like to be out of control? Yeah, okay. Maybe I have to come to that side. Control. Fuck. I mean, dirt as in bird shit, right? The bench. Trees, birds, shit. I'm trying now, regardless of the dirt. It's herb, man. It's herb therapy. Let's do it. Control. Control. Hmm. 
I didn't make it. <sighs> Why? Uh, I don't want to. It's so hot today. And I mean, it's one thing to just sit there and don't know what is there and don't give a fuck about that. It's another thing if you know it and you see there's shit. Why should I sit there, right? But not for everybody, I know. Do I feel bad? Mm. Not particular. I mean, it's like common for me to avoid things and uh, I try to at least give me the benefit of the doubt on this day when it's happening and then checking within myself, okay, how do I feel today? <laughs> and sometimes I feel more powerful and the other day I don't. Yeah, I, I wanted to sit there and right and to have that herb therapy with you and because usually better to do it not alone um, because there's always a backlash after that okay i tried it as you saw but 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 but, but, but it doesn't even matter if i show you where and what was in my mind it's not working today and that is okay because tomorrow is another day and I'm going to try that again. Later I see a friend, so we're going to sit somewhere, so... There's one more thing. A lot of friends and people ask me that. OCD, obsessive compulsive disorder. Here in Germany, where I'm currently living, this disease is just called, pardon my German, Zwangsstörung, compulsive disorder. And I find that not enough and even misleading because the main thing to understand OCD is that there is not just a compulsion. There is an obsession behind that compulsion which is pushing you towards this compulsion. For instance, uh, when you are afraid of germs then you are probably also afraid of getting sick and to make other people sick that you feel ashamed all the time that is not, not an option for you. To wash your hands not correctly it has to be clean otherwise you will harm people and you don't want it and that is the obsession which makes the compulsion bottomless pit i like that term ocd better not even because i'm talking english now because that is how it is and zwangsstörung compulsive disorder is not enough Bye, mom. Yeah, my mom passed away two years ago and that is her spot here. And I wanted to go with you here because <laughs> also maybe helping <laughs> to erping. Yeah. <laughs> it's a wonderful, wonderful world and a wonderful place here. Let's try tomorrow. Ugh, what just happened? Oh fuck. A bird shit on my head. Fuck. Oh, this is so disgusting. Now my whole day just crushed in just one brief second. I did not sit on a bench. Oh, I'm doing herb now because I'm completely in fear. I would like to just run home, wash everything and call it a fucking day. But I don't do that. And that is herb. To stand in that fear and don't do what you usually do. Clean yourself. So I just go on with my day with a smile on my face. Crushed by my fucking fear. And at some point it will go down. But until then, I feel like a retard. <laughs> Fuck. Do you know what it feels like?